everybody, how's it going? Mark here, Backcountry Pipe, out in the shed on a Wednesday. It is uh, about minus eight here today. And uh, so I don't want to have a bowl. So I got my uh, <clears throat> Stanwell. 1992 pipe and in it for the first time ever Samuel Galwith full Virginia flake it's got a uh, tin date of October 2014 and I got this from home waters one uh, way back when Jay when we did the secret Santa with Jay and I just cracked this last night and just beautiful beautiful colors a little crystallization of the sugars absolutely fantastic and uh, when I smell it the tin note I'm getting like a little bit of like a raisiny type of smell there very slight um, it was moist I let it sit out for a bit and uh, very smoky but it's a cool smoke in this pipe full Virginia and uh, It's like you get the sweetnesses, sweetness there, and uh, just a good all around, you know. Very impressed, first time ever. Being a full, uh, full Virginia, I was a little hesitant, but it's very, uh, very tasty. So, yeah, I've uh, Going through my tin of the Navy Flake, and uh, I really got to say I'm impressed with these Samuel Gow with uh, flakes, just the way they come in the tin, the presentation, quantity, and sorry, that's a crazy GSB here. Hey Willow, come here. Willow, Willow, come here. What are you doing? Hmm? Where's those birds? Where's the birds? Where's those birds? She is full of energy. Loving the fact that everybody's been working from home. And There's a lot of happy dogs in the world, I'll tell you that. A lot of happy animals overall. <clears throat> so yeah, so this blend, it's, uh, I said, it's my first uh, first bowl of it ever. And uh, nice and smooth. I don't really want to get into picking out the uh, the notes or anything like that, but... I do get a bit of a slight, like a raisin or figginess, but very, very slight. Anyway, we're almost into uh, New Year's Eve tomorrow and out with 2021. Hoping for the best, good start, fresh start to the new year. I know uh, things aren't going to magically change just by uh, having a uh, the year roll over, but let's hope by this time next year we're all in a better uh, better situation, whatever that situation may be. <clears throat> Being off between Christmas and New Year's, I found myself in the evening watching uh, some pipe videos. And uh, old pipe videos at that, but uh, it's pretty pretty good to see a lot of new presenters out there. They're well new to me because I really haven't uh, had the time to dedicate to watching videos a whole lot lately. But I do find looking online that uh, 
pipe tobacco selection is almost uh, probably like at a 50% capacity or less of what's available, which is the same for cigars. And Samuel Gawith, almost uh, almost non-existent out there for uh, being sold out in many of the spots online that I looked. Also found out that uh, I guess a Middleton Tobacco was only making uh, Carter Hall from here on out. So uh, I kind of went to look to see if there's any you know, Prince Albert around or anything like that. Sold out. Just going to be Carter Hall from here on out by the sounds of it, with, from what I've read on their website. How are you doing, Will? Successful deer season this year. There's the, uh, the rack from the nine pointer I got. Gonna get these antlers, uh, gonna do these antlers, put them on a plaque, but not a bad, uh, not a bad spread. Good season. Tomorrow here is the last of, uh, I guess it'd be grouse hunting, uh, and then it's just rabbits and uh, coyote hunting. But, I've done a lot of it this year, so I really don't have the uh, the urge. And the rabbit population around here is uh, certainly down this year. Well, my father-in-law had uh, beagles. It was always tradition, Boxing Day, and kind of this kind of week between Christmas and New Year's. We always uh, there were always a few of us always out chasing uh, chasing rabbits with the with the beagles, and that was always a good laugh, good fun. Miss those times. And Lord knows it certainly brings out uh, memories of the past this time of year. And there's always such a dead time between <clears throat> Christmas and New Year's, I find. Um, I mean, you know, my wife's back to work. She works back to work today and, and tomorrow. But uh, overall, it's, uh, you know, it's kind of just like a blah, the in-between. But it's nice to slow down and, and just, you know, not do a whole lot of anything. I guess it's a... Uh, it's okay. <laughs> anyway, seven minutes, rambling on with absolutely nothing. Just wanted to make a video from the shed saying hello. Let you know how pleasantly happy I am with this whole Virginia Lake. And hope everyone's uh, doing well. Uh, don't uh, talk to you between now and then. Uh, happy New Year. Cheers.